52 Border Collie Facts Every Owner Should Know Number 1. Border Collies have a unique ability to move quickly in a crouched position similar to cats. This is made possible by a gap between their shoulder blades that allows them to glide close to the ground. And with this remarkable trait, they can expertly herd animals with exceptional accuracy. Number 2. Breeders evaluate Border Collies for breeding based on both their practical herding skills demonstrated in the International Sheepdog Society, Sheepdog Trials, and their conformity to the breed's visual standards, including coat color and body proportions. Number 3. The the ISDA Sheepdog Trial is a traditional test still used today. In this test, a dog and handler work together to collect groups of livestock and move them quietly around a course. Number 4. In the international version of the ISDA Sheepdog Test, known as the Double Fetch, the dog's task is to gather 10 sheep from a significant distance, approximately 800 yards away. It then brings them to the center of the field and returns to gather another 10 sheep, also placed at a similar distance. Number 5. During the trial, Kali must navigate obstacles at different distances from the handler. They also need to demonstrate their ability to work closely with the handler by penning and sorting the sheep. Number 6. In New Zealand and Australia, the Border Collie standards have led to a specific look. A dog with a long double coat, a soft dark eye, a body slightly longer than tall, a well-defined stop on the forehead, semi-pricked ears, and a gentle and friendly temperament. This type of Border Collie is favored in show competitions worldwide and appreciated by respected judges. Number 7. According to appearance breed standards, the Border Collie should have a slightly curved tail reaching the hawk, lush fur, expressive intelligent eyes, and be mostly energetic with a black and white coat, sometimes brown. Number 8. Many Collie enthusiasts don't like using Border Collies as show dogs, because they worry that focusing on looks might make them less skilled at working. Border Collies can participate in other events like agility, obedience, and tracking, but these dogs don't have to match appearance standards like show dogs. Number 9. In the UK, there are two Border Collie registries. The International Cheap Dog Society focuses on breeding for herding skills, while the UK Kennel Club emphasizes breeding for appearances. Number 10. In the United States too, there are two main Border Collie registries, the American Border Collie Association and the National Border Collie Association. Both of these are focused on preserving the traditional working dog characteristics. Number 11. In 1995, the American Kennel Club officially recognized the Border Collie breed after it had been in the AKC's miscellaneous class for more than 50 years. However, this recognition was met with protests from many Border Collie groups. The groups were concerned that the emphasis on the breed's working abilities might diminish under the AKC recognition. Number 12. Despite the protests, AKC registrations for Border Collies increased over the years. By 2004, there were 1,984 new AKC registrations, and in 2005, there were 23 378 more registrations. Number 13. On the other hand, the American Border Collie Association registers around 20,000 Border Collies every year. Due to conflicting goals of working and appearance standards, in 2003, the association decided that dogs achieving a confirmation championship would be removed from the registry regardless of their ability. Number 14. In Australia, Border Collies can be registered with the Australian National Kennel Council, an affiliated state-controlled body, or with a working dog registry. Since 1986, there have been over 2,000 ANKC pedigree Border Collie registrations each year. Number 15. In Canada, Agriculture Canada recognizes the Canadian Border Collie Association as the registry for Border Collies designated as pure breed. This designation relies on herding lineage, not appearance. The registry has two tiers, A for dogs from working registries and B for those from foreign kennel clubs with no confirmation shows. Number 16. In South Africa, the South African Sheepdog Association handles the registration of working sheepdogs. ISDS registered dogs brought into the country can be shifted to the South African Sheepdog Association Association register. Dogs that are not initially registered can also become eligible by receiving a working ability certificate from a registered judge. Number 17. Working Border Collies are incredible herders. They can take commands from afar, responding to both voice and whistle signals. Their boundless energy and natural herding skills make them ideal for herding a wide range of animals from sheep and cattle to free-range poultry, pigs, and even ostriches. Number 18. Border Collies are also employed to remove unwanted wild birds from places like airport runways, golf courses, and various public and private areas. Number 19. Border Collies generally live between 10 and 17 years, and their average lifespan is around 12 years. Number 20. Border Collies belong to the medium-sized dog category. Male Border Collies typically stand 19 to 22 inches tall and weigh between 31 and 44 pounds, while females usually measure 18 to 21 inches in height and weigh between 26 and 42 pounds. 
Number 21. While the black and white color pattern is frequently observed in Boda Kalis, this breed can actually come in nearly any color and pattern that can be found in dogs. Number 22. Eye color among Boda Kalis can range from brown to blue. Sometimes, dogs with merle coats might even have eyes of different colors. Number 23. The Boda Kali breed has its origins in the Landrace Kalis, a type of dog that was common in the British Isles. The name Boda Kali comes from the breed's likely place of origin, which is along the border between England and Scotland, also known as the Anglo-Scottish border. Number 24. The term Collie type began to be mentioned in writings towards the end of the 19th century. This suggests that the specific type of dog we know as the Border Collie was recognized and differentiated from other Collie types during this time. Number 25. The term Collie existed in the Scots language before the 19th century. In the context of the Scots language, Collie was used to describe specific types of dogs that were considered useful or working dogs in Scotland. Number 26. There's a belief that the term Collie could have originated from an old Celtic word that meant useful. This suggests that the name might have been used to describe the breed's practicality and helpfulness in various tasks. Number 27. The Roman Empire was the first civilization to introduce sheep and shepherds to the British Isles, where they began a wool industry. When the Roman sheepdogs struggled in the cold weather, the Celts began breeding their own, eventually leading to the development of the Border Collie. Number 28. In 1915, the term Border Collie was coined by James Reed, the secretary of the ISDS in the UK. This term was used to distinguish ISDS registered dogs from the Kennel Club's Collie, which had developed a different type of appearance after entering the show ring in 1860, mixing with other dog breeds. Number 29. All pure Border Collies today can trace their lineage back to Old Hemp, a tricolor dog born in 1893. Old Hemp was bred by Adam Telfer from a black and tan dog Roy and Meg, a black-coated, strong-eyed dog. Hemp was a quiet, powerful dog to which sheep responded easily. His working style became the hallmark Border Collie style. Number 30. Whiston Cap, born on September 28, 1963, is the dog depicted in the ISDS badge in the classic herding pose associated with Border Collies. Whiston was a highly regarded dog in the breed's history, and his genetic lineage can be found in the majority of today's Border Collie bloodlines. Number 31. The very first sheepdog trials took place in 1873 in Bala, North Wales. These events originally helped farmers and shepherds choose breeding partners for their working dogs. Over time, these trials transformed into a sport, attracting participants beyond the farming community. Number 32. Border Collies with natural herding instincts can be trained for sheepdog trials and other herding competitions. They're also skilled at dog agility, even excelling at higher jumps. In England, some competitions even have separate classes for non-collie dogs, all because of the remarkable agility skills possessed by Border Collies. Number 33. Border Collies' speed, agility, and endurance make them top performers in activities like fly ball and disc dog competitions. Their ease of training also makes them a popular choice for dog dancing competitions. Number 34. Border Collies boast an extraordinary sense of smell and an unwavering drive, making them exceptional tracking dogs. They thrive in tracking trials that simulate a thrilling hunt for lost individuals in controlled scenarios, where their performance shines and can earn them prestigious titles. Number 35. Border Collies play a crucial role as search dogs in mountain rescue operations in Britain. They have a remarkable ability to search large hillside areas and locate individuals in avalanche sites. Number 36. Hamish McKins, a renowned mountain expert, noted that Boda Collies and other dogs with dark coats are less prone to snow blindness, which can be especially advantageous in snowy mountain conditions. Number 37. In the world of dog intelligence, Boda Collies shine like brilliant stars. Rico, a Boda Collie from Germany, recognized 200 objects by name. Betsy, a Boda Collie from Vienna, Austria, mastered over 300 words. And Chaser, a Boda Collie from South Carolina, the world's smartest dog, knows more than a thousand object names. Number 38. Boda Collies have even topped the list of Stanley Corrin's doggy intelligence and obedience ranking out of 208 different dog breeds. According to Corrin's assessment, Boda Collies exhibit exceptional problem-solving skills and obedience, making them the brightest in the canine world. Number 39. Another touching story of unwavering loyalty similar to Hachiko the Akita, who waited for his owner, involves a border collie named Shep. In 1936, Shep watched his deceased master being loaded onto a train at a railway station. And just like Hachiko, Shep remained there for the next five and a half years, patiently waiting his master's return. Number 40. A border collie named Striker holds the Guinness World Record for the fastest car window opened by a dog, achieving the speed in just 11.34 seconds. Number 41. Jean, also recognized as the Vitagraph dog, was a female collie famous for her roles in silent films. She was owned and trained by director Lawrence 
Lance Trimble and holds the distinction of being the first canine to take a leading role in motion pictures. Number 42, Sheila, the first civilian dog ever, has been awarded the PDSA Dickin Medal for her part in rescuing the crew of a B-17 Flying Fortress, which crashed into the Cheviot Hills Northumberland in 1944. Number 43, Border Collies have a natural instinct for herding sheep, and the story of Tilly, a remarkable Border Collie, brings this instinct to life. After surviving a car crash in Idaho, Tilly's true calling shined when she was found on a neighboring farm joyfully herding sheep just two days later. Number 44, even Queen Victoria couldn't resist the allure of Border Collies. In the early 1860s, she became an avid enthusiast of this breed, contributing to its distinction from the modern Collie. Number 45, the renowned Scottish poet Robert Burns also cherished his Border Collie named Luath. When Luath met a sad end, Burns penned the moving poem The Two Dogs, celebrating their unique connection. Many statues of Robert Burns also feature Luath, a loyal companion, right by his side. Number 46, Jumpy, another incredible border collie, clinched a Guinness World Record for skateboarding, covering 100 meters in just 20 seconds. Number 47, back in 2008, a border collie mix named Sweet Pea achieved something amazing. She balanced a can on her head and strolled for 100 meters in just 2 minutes and 55 seconds, setting a new record in dog balancing. Number 48, Babe, the 1995 comedy drama film, is about a pig that becomes a sheep herder despite many challenges. In the movie, border collies are part of the cast and also play the role of herding sheep. Number 49, Border Collies have also showcased their talents in other various movies like Animal Farm and Snow Dogs, as well as in the popular 90s TV series Mad About You. Number 50, in a recent incident in England, a remarkable Border Collie named Blitz proved his life-saving skills. A 51-year-old woman had gone missing for more than a day, prompting Jess Elmore, a dedicated volunteer search and rescue handler, to enlist the help of her trusty dog Blitz. Trained for such situations, Blitz skillfully searched the area and successfully located the missing woman. Blitz found the woman hidden under the thick foliage, where her presence might have gone unnoticed by human searchers alone. Number 51, Border Collies also have a surprising job as Goose Masters, trained to shoot geese away. Down in Florida, there's a Border Collie named B who takes on the Goose Master duty at the University of North Florida, making sure the geese steer clear of busy areas. And number 52, Border Collies have also found their way into the hearts of various celebrities such as James Dean, Anna Paquin, Bon Jovi, Ethan Hawke, James Franco, and Tiger Woods. Alright guys, which of these facts intrigued you the most? Let us know in the comments below.